lines for tornado afraid are like ridiculously long. Oh, so you need to be fully rested for the long lines. Yeah, and it's gonna be hard because we're so excited. So and grateful. Mm, and I was born yesterday. Marco, bed check is at eleven. Hope you're where you're supposed to be by then, or your ass is mine. We sure fooled her. So you dragged your brother into this too. Huh? Love me. Apparently, everybody else could know what was going on except me. No, uh, no, mommy. I actually, you were the reason everyone. Uh, I mean, you, you just, look, you're the reason it seemed like it was true. Honestly, I mean, the way you you glared at McBain like you wanted to tear him apart. And me. And yeah, you're you're the reason everyone thought Tali and I were through. I hate all this deception. And I hate it when you think that you're charming me. So, charade over? Can we get back to normal, whatever that is? Uh, not quite yet. Unfortunately, we still don't know who Ramsey was hiding. We don't know why he was killed. So, so I still get the thrill of watching you hanging all over John McBain? Well, you know, we demand cops to go beyond the call of duty. Except making nice with McBain, you know was above and beyond uh -huh. the call of duty. Well, actually, I, I thought it was getting kind of easy, you know? I um, kind of thought it was pretty fun. All right. Yeah. We have to solve this case soon. <clears throat> they can't be dead. The last thing I remember was him telling me that he was going to take me to the new doctor. Today. Do you remember anything from yesterday? Before I found you. There was a... Uh, there was... He was yelling and then... And, 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 and there was loud, loud noises. Yeah, gunshot. <sighs> Sorry, Marty. Ramsey's gone. <laughs> Whoever this woman is, she's in for a rough recovery. See that? Mm. It's evidence of fractures to the L2 and L3 vertebrae. And a healing for a wound like that takes months of operations, and then there's the rehab. I doubt she's even ambulatory. Were you able to tell anything from the CT scan? <clears throat> yeah, the scan's dated back in December. You don't have anything more recent? No, I gave you everything I had. Well, without anything more recent to compare it to, I can only speculate. Just, so. give, me, just give it your best shot, Mike. She definitely suffered a severe head injury. And again, you know, without seeing her, I can't be sure, but she could be PVS, a persistent vegetative state. And even if she's not, she could have any degree of post-head injury dementia. What's that like? Like a memory loss? Yeah, or seizures or a severely altered personality. So what you're saying is the person this woman was before may not be who she is now. For all we know, she's a blank slate. Ah, yes. Now I see why Miss Sahid is so important. Don't worry. It's a delicate situation, and I will handle it with care. Well, if it means anything, Antonio hated tricking you. Like, you, most of all. Well, I guess I'll just have to forgive him. Someday. Huh. Mommy enjoys prolonged apologies. And what this is doing to Jamie. It's been hard. It's been hard on me, too. I, I love her. You know, Mommy, I I can't possibly ask her to keep a secret like this. No. I mean, that would probably be worse. So right now, I just, I just gotta spend a lot of time with her. Let her know that I'm okay. And just wait for the day that I can tell her that Talia's back in our lives. You know I should still be furious with you, Antonio. But I just don't have it in me. I'm so happy to see you guys together. I can't even be angry anymore. Well, we're pretty happy, too. Just me? Great. 
The co-conspirator. She knows? She knows. She knows. How's Sarah? She's good. Hungry, actually. Can I get some uh, vegetables to go? And some of that chicken adobo, too, for me. Mmm. She's hungry. That's a good sign. Yeah. Thanks, Mom. Chicken for me. So, what's going on with the case? Well, it's, uh, it's pretty clear that uh, Ramsey was murdered trying to sell the stolen jewels. Um, McBain took out the two guys who shot him. Um, other than that, nobody's talking. So, what do you do now? Right now, we're just focusing on trying to find the guy that held you and Sarah up. And we're going to look for the girl that he was looking for, that lady. All right. Do you think she's connected to the stolen goods? Well, McBain apparently saw her running out of Ramsey's place right after the killing, so we need to find her. <sighs> Christian's right. I am a bad mother. Maybe, but you're the only one I have. Uh, what was he uh, talking about? Why? Why are you so sad? Uh, Jessica's husband died. Oh my God! Yeah, I'm writing a song for his funeral. That was that song I heard you singing in the park. That that was for him. That was beautiful. And if I hadn't been thinking about number one. I would have already told you. You just did. Honey, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry I missed so much of your life. <sighs> yeah, you did. <sighs> well, let's stick to the present tense now. Oh, yeah. Yeah, great. <laughs> present tense. And here I have involved you in all my... All my mess. Well, I wouldn't mind so much if I knew what the mess was. Tina. Um, I don't want to lose you again. What the hell is going on? So what's the story with this case? Just can't leave the room. Of course. We think that maybe Ramsey's murder is connected to the jewelry heist at Lindsay Rappaport's gallery. No way. No. Yeah. Right. One theory is that Ramsey set the whole thing up and then got double-crossed by the buyer. When we got to the penthouse, all the money and jewels were gone. And so then what does the injured woman have to do with it? I don't know. We were thinking maybe motive. You know, Ramsey had all these articles and, and, and journals about these expensive experimental treatments. Right. You know, somehow he, he had to find a way to pay for all that. And now she's missing. Yeah. So you think that the people who killed Ramsey, maybe they have her? I don't know, Mike. When we got inside, the only person that was alive was Todd Manning. Here you go. Why bother if you're going to kill me? I don't know how many times I have to tell you. I'm not going to hurt you, Marty. I'm trying to help you out. You killed Lee. No, I didn't. Then who did? I had no idea. He was dead when I got here. And they might have killed you, too, if I hadn't got you out of there. Why would anybody want to kill Lee? Maybe they were looking for you. Then what am I doing here? Why haven't you taken me to the police? Ramsey was the police. So, I'm not trusting the police anymore. Neither should you. But I should trust you. I don't even know your name. I'm Todd. Cole, please try to understand. What's there to understand? All right, you're sorry that we made love. I'm sorry that I got pregnant. I'm really sorry about yeah, with that. With our baby that you don't want. What I want is to know that this baby will be taken care of, okay? And you know, Cole, you know there are adults out there that, that want 
a need of a kid right now. 